Father and son bike ride turned deadly on Sunday after the 12 year old was hit by a car in Costa Mesa. That driver has now been charged with murder. For the first time, only on NBC4, Vicki Vargas spoke to the family now grappling with this tragedy. Eleanor Baskin says her husband actually saw the car coming, realized it was not going to stop, and so he tried to get the driver's attention. My husband called me um, from the site and said that something happened. It was something Eleanor Baskin could not fathom. Her husband and 12 year old son Noel were bike riding near this intersection when police say the driver of a rented pickup ran the stop sign, crashed into the little boy, and killed him. They say he was driving under the influence. Smile. Now there are only memories of Noel Bascon. His mother says he had an infectious grin, a seventh grader who loved gummy candy and enjoyed being able to finally go back to school. He's a sweet, smiling, energetic, uh, happy boy. Um, he loves being outdoors in the parks. She tells us the beach was a favorite spot that Noel knew how to give a big high five, and that her husband, who saw it all, is devastated. Just an innocent boy enjoying a regular bike ride, and he never came back home. The driver, Richard Lavelle, was charged with murder. Investigators say he had a prior DUI in 2013. His passenger also arrested on drug-related charges. He's a menace to society. He needs to be locked up for life so he doesn't do this to anybody else again. Noel's parents both work in medical care and have witnessed heartache firsthand during the pandemic. Now the pain is far too close to home. Eleanor Baskin says she and her daughter would have been on that bike ride, something they often do as a family, but Sunday night they were home wrapping Christmas presents. In Costa Mesa, Vicki Vargas, NBC4 News.